All right, so because of this, I've clearly got to do something right now. And I have a few ideas for how to make some sort of filter, but I need something right now. On that vein, I've created this. So as a lot of you may have come to know, Folgers coffee cans are kind of like my duct tape of aquaponics. So of course, my really simple and only temporary, I promise, solids filter solution involved a coffee can. It's working pretty well though. So here you can see just how basic this setup really is. And I've finally got a waterfall. So there you go. It's kind of nice. All I did was I cut a line in the handle part of the Folgers can and hoped it would work. And that made the waterfall part of this nice and simple. I like simple. Rearranged my pipe a little bit so it shoots down and into the back of the can just to kind of force the water in there. Now, a solids filter is what I promised here, so watch what I'm going to do. Dollar store scrubby pad. Right in the handle there. Is that going to stop everything? No. Is that going to stop a lot of things? Oh, I think so. So there you go. Sort of a 10 second solution instant solids filter and waterfall feature from a coffee can and a scrubby. This will do for now. Fear not, I do have something much better in mind, but this will definitely do for now. Alright, so after having watched the filter for a few minutes, I made some minor changes. I put in three of these little scrubbies, I don't know, and uh, added two more, to, again to make three of the filter pads. And while I did have it tucked in there initially, I was having some issues with the flow on the edge of my waterfall. And I found that just by letting it get pressed up against the side there, that worked just fine. And I have much cleaner edges. All right, this really is the end. Thank you all for checking it out. Have a fantastic day.